With a few days off from work, I decided to go in search of a dead mall, preferably one I'd never been to before. Searching for a viable yet dead mall, I found many listed as permanently closed. This included Schuylkill Mall in Frackville, Pennsylvania, which was a huge disappointment, but nearby and still open is Fairlane Village Mall. Fairlane opened in 1974 and has seen major changes in each decade since. It's located in Pottsville, Pennsylvania, directly off of Route 61. Schuylkill Mall was located six miles north in Frackville. A bonus feature of what's left of that mall is at the end of this video. Fairlane is a small mall anchored by a Coles and a Boscovs. The middle portion is currently being redeveloped and outdoor access stores have been added, such as Dollar Tree and the craft store Michaels. Dunham, which used to be an anchor at nearby Schuylkill Mall, is being relocated into a 43,000 square foot section in the center portion of Fairlane. Construction was fully underway during my visit. Being as you can't walk through the construction area, you need to walk along the outside sidewalk to get from the Coles and Michaels and the Chinese Buffet to the north end of the mall where the other stores and many other vacancies are. The Boscov's end has the most stores, although they've been compacted a bit to accommodate the construction. These stores include Super Shoes, K's, Schuylkill Valley Sports, a few eateries, nail salon, winery, and a piercing kiosk. There's a long string of vacant stores which lead up to a wall that becomes the back end of the Dollar Tree which is accessible from the outside. Areas of sidewalk need a lot of repair, as do some of the undersides of the entryways in two different locations. The outdoor plants seen here are in a shady location, but they do seem to be doing well. The mall has skylights, so the trees that are located inside of the mall also seem to be doing fairly well, which is a good sign. One would hope with the coming renovations that they would do some cosmetic work to the outside of the building. The boarded up movie theater seen here had closed in 2010 and was last a car mic. It's been vacant ever since. This entire section of the mall is a very small area with two vacant units in addition to the theater. The only thing still open in this small section of the mall on the southern end is the Chinese buffet. The rest of the section connects to the side of Michael's which is accessible only from the outside. Beyond Michael's on the extreme southern end of the mall is the Anchor Coles. I have no particular attachment to Fairlane Valley Mall. 
I had never even heard of it before I found it in searching for dead malls in my area to visit. It was a long drive hindered by traffic problems, but it was a very scenic drive. I was unable to find any videos of this mall online and was surprised to see that it was overlooked by many dead mall videographers who had visited other malls in the area, including Schuylkill and Cresona malls. It's not a mall I'm likely to revisit, but it would be interesting to see how things turn out after the renovations. It's also surprising that the much larger and newer Schuylkill Mall was the one in the area to fail first, but that's just how the trend has gone for malls in America in general. Before leaving, I stopped at the Out Parcel Friendlies and talked to a waitress there who had informed me that Schuylkill Mall was pretty close by. I didn't realize it was that close to where I was, so I decided to take a drive up there, actually completely forgetting that it had been closed completely and demolished. The bonus feature that follows shows what I found when I got there.